it's funny. I get the chills just, you know, thinking about it. I'm good. I'm definitely uh, a lot better today knowing that they got the suspect in custody alive last night. Um, we were all celebrating last night. It was, I know it's an odd thing to celebrate, but at the same time, it was so massive and it was so intense. The entire city had shut down. Everyone was terrified. You know, this is a guy who's throwing grenades at police and shooting at cops. And so um, we were all so in like celebration mode yesterday. So I feel really good right now. I mean, now I think the, the focus needs to shift back to the victims and making sure that we're supporting those families as much as we can and letting them know that we're not going to let this just go away and forget it. And, you know, it's, it's crazy. But I will say I was so proud of Boston. And so, I mean, there's I have a, an image I tweeted out where it was a desolate Kenmore Square in Boston, which never happens. It's like Times Square being empty. And they were like, if you with us, we will, hunt, we will shut our city down and we will hunt you down. And I just said to my boyfriend today, who's also from Boston, I said, only Boston, we're so tight knit and we're just like, do not mess with us. And I think people will really think twice, I really do. Yeah, you look hi. absolutely beautiful. Thank you. How are you yes, doing? Good, good to see you too. You. I'll see you inside, right? Um, he looks great. Yeah, I know. He really does. So anyway, I love that. I love that about us. I love that, you know, the country came together in such a big way. I mean, hello, the New York Yankees the singing Yankees. Sweet Caroline and everything else. I mean, yes. what does that tell you? Well, and you also, know, as a Red Sox fan, that's incredible. It's incredible. And I also loved the fact that all the, um, I tweeted out video today of all the Major League Baseball games across the country when they heard the news, how they all celebrated and cheered and everybody was just one. And I was just overwhelmed by the fact that in these awful tragedies, you just see there's so much more good than bad. <clears throat> than bad, excuse me. We completely outnumber them, and you know, we just now have to be really vigilant, unfortunately.